just on the Canterbury quarter. Craig Young still able to uh, flick it back for Clark. Interception from Nissen. Glenn Nissen's now on the halfway mark. Put the glasses down. Glenn Nissen's going to put this down underneath the dot. The interception from about 32 metres out from his own line. And the Bulldogs soar further in front. Yes, a classic intercept. There was good work here from Craig Young because he sucked the defence to him and given a pass even though he was just about to go down. Then Brett Clark came up with a long cutout pass that might have led to something out wide had it gone to a St George player, but it didn't. It went to Nissen. But he's a fleet-footed lad. We've seen him score some tries here before. And directly underneath the post he goes. See it again. Now watch Craig Young here. He does very well. Goes forward, sucks a few to him, offloads. And then Brett Clark could see a man out there he thought unmarked. Well, he wasn't because <laughs> there it was. The intercept was taken. Selby was the man he intended the pass to go for. Nissen speeding away with a look of pain on his face, but he's looking over the shoulder and suddenly develops into a bit of a smile as he realised he scored a very good try for his club. The doorman, eh? <laughs> they certainly did have to shut the door when Nissen took that. Former Penrith player. <laughs> and Terry Lamb has been uh, presented with a, another gift two points 100% record tonight two kicks, two goals well I would think it would be a 100% record if he's going to get them there all night too no, he did have one from out further didn't he, his first one was out a little while yeah, two from three have been directly in front so Terry Lamb again says thank you very much and the Bulldogs shoot to a 10 points to nothing lead over St George.